Hi guys, welcome to AC Technical. Today I will show you step by step how to fix recovery options not found in Windows 11 or how to delete and recreate the Windows recovery partition using just a bootable Windows 11 USB and command prompt. Here I will also cover how to extract missing winre.wim file directly from the Windows 11 ISO. So you will have a fully working recovery environment again. This is especially useful if your recovery partition is broken or if you see recovery options not found when trying to boot into advanced startup. Plug in your Windows 11 bootable USB. If you don't have a Windows 11 bootable USB, then here's a certain tutorial for you. Now restart your PC. Now go to your PC's BIOS or BIOS boot manager to boot from the USB. And when the Windows setup screen appears, press Shift plus F10. That opens command prompt inside the recovery environment. Now let's delete the old broken recovery partition. Type disk part and press enter. Next type list disk and press enter. After that type select disk your boot disk number. As you can see here I have multiple disks. Here my boot disk number is 1. Now press enter. Next type list partition and press enter. Here find the partition leveled recovery. Usually 500 MB to 1 GB in size. Select partition your recovery partition number and press enter. Next type delete partition override and press enter. Then type exit and press enter to leave the disk part. Now we will need to identify the OS drive later because it may not be C always in recovery mode. In command prompt type C colon then press enter and type dir and press enter to confirm. If you don't see folders like Windows, Program Files, Users, try the next drive. Type D colon and press enter and type dir to confirm. If you not found, keep testing with EF etc until you find the one with those folders. That drive letter is your actual Windows partition. As you can see here my OS drive letter is F. Once you found, just remember it. You will need it later. Now we will create a new recovery partition. Let's go back into disk part. Type disk part and press enter. Next type list disk and press enter. Next type cell disk your boot disk number and press enter. Next type list partition and press enter. After that select partition your main windows partition number and press enter. Next type string desire equals 1024 and press enter. Ok just a minute let me reconfirm my windows partition. Alright partition 2 is my windows partition. Now type create partition primary size equals 1024 and press enter. Ok as you can see a primary partition created successfully. Now type format quick fs equals ntfs level equals under inverted comma recovery and press enter. Next type assign letter equals Z and press enter. Type exit and press enter. This process will shrink your windows partition by 1GB. Creates a new NTFS partition called recovery. 
and assign it with the drive letter Z. Next, we will need to put a fresh copy of winre.wim into that partition. Since our system does not have it, we will extract it directly from the Windows 11 ISO that already on our USB drive. Now go to the sources folder on the USB. As you can see, in my case, it's drive H. Type this command and press enter. dism space forward slash get hyphen wim info space forward slash wim file colon your bootable USB drive letter colon backslash sources backslash install dot wim and press enter. This will show the list of all the Windows edition inside the image. Note the index number of your edition. For example, in my case, it's Windows 11 Pro. Now mount that edition into a temporary folder and copy that file by typing this command one by one and press enter. This process mount the Windows 11 Pro image. Then it takes the winari.wim file from it. After that copies it into our new recovery partition and then unmounts to free storage. Once done, close the command prompt and restart your computer. Once restart into Windows, then open command prompt as administrator. Now go to the file explorer to identify the recovery drive later because it may not be set in the running ways. Yeah, as you can see, my recovery drive later is changed from Z to I. And type these commands one by one and press enter. This re-registered the recovery environment. After applying these commands, you should not see WinRE status enabled. Now finally, let's hide the recovery partition so it does not show in Explorer. Type disk part and press enter. Next type list disk and press enter. Next type select disk your boot disk number and press enter. Next type list partition and press enter. Now type select partition your recovery partition number and press enter. 
after that type remove letter equals your recovery drive letter and press enter once done next type exit don't worry windows will still use this partition it just won't clutter your drives list now that's it now let's see the result when you press shift plus restore you should see all the recovery options again with brand new recovery environment So I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.